Hey everybody, it's Missy Wolf and I'm here at the Nashville Elvis Festival with one of the finalists. We have Gib Maynard here. How are you? I'm doing well. Thank you. It's good to be here. It is good to be here. It is so much fun watching you guys. Do you have fun up there on stage? Oh yeah. I mean, I think I, I can at least speak for myself, but probably for uh, all of the Elvis tribute artists. I mean, it's you're just you're in your element there. I mean, it's it's what you dream to do. It's what you love to do. So. And every time you're up on that stage along with some of your friends, um, I hear those ladies down there screaming. What does that do for you when you see them doing that? It's, uh, you know, I, I consider that uh, the people that come to the, the contest, the fans that all the guys have, they're, they're really just Elvis fans. So it's kind of like their own loan to us, you know. So if we can make them happy, then I think it, it brings a certain amount of joy. Well, yeah. I definitely think you made them happy today. Um, there was one lady who was saying that after your performance, she needed a cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> so I thought it was great and it was a lot of fun. But I mean, I'm sure you have to hear some fun stories and, and encounter some wild and crazy fans who just absolutely adore you to the sure. max. So what, what is that like for you, though, in those moments? Um, like I said, you know, it, you people miss Elvis so much, yeah. you know, and they're on there'll never be another Elvis at all. Right. But if you can just bring back those memories, uh, it really transports people back uh, just for a moment, even in time, uh, to a glimpse of the past, you know? So right. it, it really, like I said, it just really gives you a great satisfaction. I mean, a, a good feeling to be able to do that. Well, and watching it from where we are, you know, watching you guys up on stage, there are those brief moments where you feel like the king is literally there. Like you close your eyes and you can you can hear him and, and you can just see him and feel his presence there. And that to me is really powerful. But just being there watching you guys up on stage, it takes a lot of work. How long do you have to practice, you know, the movements and, and the songs before you get up there to perform them? It does take a lot of work. Um, and everybody that was here today was fantastic. Mm -hmm. And um you know, um, a good Elvis tribute artist, I feel like, is one that uh, watches Elvis again and again. They watch how he moves. They watch how he walks, how he talks, how he carries his body, um, how he sings, of course, and mm -hmm. and try and rehearses that. Um, you know, I, I would I probably try to sing, you know, 10, 12 hours a week, at least 15 hours a week, sometimes more, you know, uh, as much as I can, because I mean, he was just so good. You know, you'll never come close, but you want to do him justice. Well, I think you definitely do him justice. Thank so you. thank you as a big Elvis fan myself. I think you do a great job. Where can fans find you? Um, I am on Facebook. Uh, you can find me at Elvis tribute artist, Gib Maynard. And um, also uh, my website is www.etx, like East Texas. So it's etxelvis.com. All right, guys. Well, you heard him, so check him out and be sure to attend the next Nashville Elvis Festival if you get a chance. Until next time, guys, we'll see you soon.